Star. Star, are you okay? Star. Star. Star, come on, wake up. Wake up. Wake up, Star. That's it, come on, open your eyes, Star. Come on, you can do it. Come on, hey. Hey, you remember me? Twinkle? Don't call me that. Oh, my God, I'm gonna never turn you around. How you doing? You okay? Uh, I don't know. Oh, well, move something. Come on, wiggle your toes, you know, your fingers, something. Wait, how did this happen? How did we get off road? You don't remember? I wouldn't be asking you if I did. Well, you thought you saw an animal and then you grabbed the wheel. Oh, right, an animal ran in the road. I mean, did you see it? Barely. What was it, like a little chipmunk or something? What, you don't break for animals? Not one smaller than my fist. It's still a living thing. Yeah, well, so's a spider, but you don't stop the car every time a spider's crossing the street. Otherwise, you end up in a ditch with a wrecked car. So you're saying that you would have smushed it if I didn't grab the wheel? It's better than smushing you. Hey, where are you going? You can't just leave me like... Yeah, I know. Are you seriously blaming this on me? It was barely even an accident. Look, there are no scratches or dents on this thing. Nothing. Would you just get out from under there and check out how lucky we got? Lucky? No, I don't think so, Twinkle. What are you talking about? I can practically check out every inch of this thing. It looks fine. Not the axle. Well, what's wrong with the axle? It's cracked in two. What does that mean? It means the car is useless. It's total. So it's not worth 50 grand? It's not worth 50 bucks, which makes it kind of difficult to tell my buddy Bull to cash it in. Well, what are we going to do now? Star, there's no we, okay? You've done enough. You were ready to give up your car so I could pay back Bull. Yeah, but now he's expecting this tomorrow, and he's not going to get it. Because I wrecked it. Hey, no, you didn't wreck it. I'm the one that grabbed the wheel. <sighs> Star, listen to me. This is not your fault, okay? I let this become your problem, and I never should have done that. Oh, what's done is done. Not if I go to plan B. I think we passed plan B a couple plans ago. Okay, fine. Plan D, then. All right, whatever it is, tell me. Okay, so the plan is to meet Bull like we originally planned. But if we don't have the car, then what good is that going to do? I'm going to work off the money, okay? How? I'll go back to Ohio with Bull. And I'll start stealing cars again from my dad's chop shop. You can't go back home to your dad. Why not? He beats you. So there are worse things. What, like working for a criminal? Or, or breaking the law? Or risk your life in jail? That's probably the worst thing and you got away from all of that. You can't stop now. I know, all right? But I went about it all wrong. First by stealing that money. The biggest mistake that I made was getting you involved in this. Sorry, and I'm, I am so sorry for that. That's over with, okay? No, not okay. Look, you've been great. A major pain in the ass, but, but you've been great. And you've been through enough, and all I want now is for you to be safe. So just let me do what I've got to do, okay? Is going back to Ohio really the only way? Yeah, this is our last night together. This time tomorrow, I'll be back where my dad wants me, and you'll be back home safe with your family.